news. Today we are talking about food that's not quite what it seems to be. Our registered dietitian Lisa Grezelonik is here today with some scrumptious looking foods that are actually good for you. Yeah. Surprise, mm -hmm. surprise. Which surprise. is a good, yes, which is a good trick. And we're taste testing? Is that what we're going to do a little swap taste testing. Okay. So what we're going to look at today is some real favorite foods of ours. For example, pasta. We all love pasta. Yes, with the pasta. And pasta kind of gets a bad rap these days because we know it's loaded in calories and high in carbohydrate. The good news is there's some swaps we can do to take that all away. Okay. So one thing we have over here, what's on the end there, Cassandra, is some spaghetti squash. Ah. Spaghetti squash only has about 50 calories per cup compared to 400 for a cup of Can pasta. Go over there and eat? Yep. Okay. And all it is on top is a, um, a meat sauce on there. And it looks just like... It's a swap for pasta. So okay. you can save substantial calories and substantial carbohydrate by swapping out your pasta for oh. spaghetti squash. Okay? Mm -hmm. And if you're not sure how to do it, we've talked about it a little bit in the past. I brought an example real quick to show you. You have a spaghetti squash at home. How I make it is I slab a couple holes in it, put it in the oven at 400 degrees for about 40 minutes. The whole thing, you don't the cut whole it in thing. half? I don't okay. cut it in half. Then when it's done, I take a hot pad and I cut it in half. Okay. And I'm lazy, so then I take a little scoop out, but I don't futz with all this beforehand. Okay. And you just scoop that out, okay, you're going to get all the those seeds out of there. You mm -hmm. take a fork, Shred it and it's going to flick out. That's all spaghetti squash is. Super Wonderful. easy. Then we have another swap, which is called shirataki noodles. Yeah, and I want to try these. What these are, there's different brands out there. Get the ones made from yam root. Okay, there's some made oh. with tofu. Get the ones from yam root. I was so excited when I, when I came across the shirataki And noodles. these are essentially, Actually, you know, 20 calories per bag. Personally. There's uh, no carbohydrate in them, and, and they're, they're good for your gut health, actually. Plant root? They're, they're yam root. Ow! Oh, shoot! So yeah. yam root is like uh, rutabaga, shoot. right? It's it's a you know a potato starch family, let's just say. But it's mm. interesting in how the the fiber. See, I'm going to do that, Nicole. But I'm also the fiber in it is a is a really good fiber is. for our gut health. And I so like that. you will find these in the refrigerated section in the mm. produce area. So another swap. Get a bag, try I like it out. That. You may like it, may not. And there's like 20 calories. Oh, 20 calories in a bag. So again, we're talking 400 really? calories for pasta to 20. Yeah. Huge savings. Then let's move on to another favorite, mashed potatoes. Okay. What we do here is we cook some cauliflower, whip it up with a little bit of cream cheese and some butter. I have the recipe on yourtastylife.com. There's more adventurous things you can do. You can check out the uh, recipe. But all this is is simply mashed potatoes. It's, it's a fake out mashed potato, let's just say. It's cauliflower with some butter oh, and cream that cheese. Great. That's really good. So again, mm -hmm. five carbs, minimal calories. We're talking 30 calories per cup compared to the high mm. carb and calorie low potatoes. Butter on here? Yeah. Some butter on I there. haven't had butter in months. Grass <laughs> 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 had butter, this, Nicole. It's still so good. This is a cauliflower. This is cauliflower. Once, you just put in a food processor and you get these little snowflakes. So do you steam it first or nope. do you just this is put raw. It in raw? So for rice, we just, we just process ah, it raw okay. Okay. in a food processor. And then you put it in a pan. And what's in here now is, again, just a little coconut oil. Put a little bit of seasonings in there. Just like sauteed? And, yep, sauteed in your pan. And that's a rice substitute. Again, huge savings. The story repeats itself. You save calories, you save carbs. It's delicious, oh, and this is a great that way to. That's the coconut. Yeah, it's a great way to sneak in vegetables. Mm. Great way for the kids to get more vegetables. For kids. I that like this. Mm -hmm. It's cool. Then we got to move on to some drink swaps. So if you like a sugary drink, one thing you can do that's out there is there's a product called True Lemon, and what it is is a replacement product that's no artificial sweeteners, no preservatives, no artificial flavors. Ten calories per little packet. And it, this, is, this is a lemonade swap, okay? okay so you can go ahead and have a sip of that. There's raspberry lemonade, regular lemonade. But it's one thing that I would say is a oh, decent fabulous. swap. But because some of those are artificial with sweet junk. Yes. Yeah. Wow. And this one I prefer because there's this some of them. This is 10 calories? This 10 glass? 10 calories in oh. that glass. Some of them have all these fake sweeteners that you're talking. This yeah, one here, like they use stevia. And then some of them use a pinch of sugar, less than a teaspoon per oh, packet. Nice. Lastly, we want a rich, robust flavor. Maybe yeah. we're too heavy of a coffee drinker. What do we use? Ticino is a good swap out. It has a, It has a robust coffee-like flavor. It's a no-caffeine, no-acid tea. Oh. Different flavors again, and it comes in little packets like I'm such. Look at face. Do you like it's it? Good. Oh. Okay. It's good. It's good. There's no I mean, packets. It's not gonna cut you make it coffee. like tea, okay. or they have that eggs. Cup? Could I put coffee creamer and Splenda in here? Oh boy. Uh, well, let's talk about the Splenda another time. But 
Uh, this is good. Yes, the people are this surprised. This is really good. It's a little tea. I just ripped it, but a little tea bag. You put you hot water that. over it. You brew it like tea. It's a coffee-like oh. flavor, and there's also um, bags you can brew it in your coffee pot like normal coffee. Interesting. So again, trying to cut down caffeine. Good idea. There I you go. really like that. Yeah. I like all of these. I want that butter. I like yes. using I that to steam it all, too. To come on Get back to the grass <laughs> butter. Good ideas. Okay. So easy swaps. April Fool's. You're eating more vegetables, and you didn't know it. Right. What else can we say? I love it. Uh, yeah, be healthy, you guys. All right, we're going to take a short break. We'll be right back.